guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are here to do a budget check-in for November. We are going to actually be looking at the past two weeks because I was not able to film my week three budget check-in last week. We were moving into our house and everything, so now things are finally getting settled. We're almost, almost all the way unpacked. Uh, we still need to hang like wall art and um, do a little bit more like organization, but for the most part, we're pretty settled. So today is actually Thursday, Thanksgiving day. So happy Thanksgiving. I hope that you all have a wonderful day. Um, just being grateful for everything that you've been blessed with in your life. I know this morning I am feeling very, very grateful. It has been a weird year um, for a lot of us, but you know, there's still always something to be grateful for. So anyways, I wanted to kind of walk through and track our transactions, um, make note of the goal of the bills that have come out. I know T-Mobile actually came out this morning. I meant to put this in a little earlier. I have a little bit of a headache because I'm trying <laughs> to decrease my like caffeine and sugar intake a little bit and I didn't have any yesterday and I've noticed that I definitely have a bit of a headache going on. So let me see here. So I'm just logging into my, um, hmm, oh, wrong one, my bank to see, yeah, T-Mobile 148.11. So we'll go ahead and write that in, 148.11, that was paid, APS has not come out yet. Um, HP Insta Inc. Uh, was a transaction that I forgot to put in, or a bill I forgot to put in, so I'm gonna use my lasso real quick and just uh, make sure that's on images, and we will copy that, or actually just copy this a little bit, because I don't need the handwriting, and that I will put, it technically came out on the 25th, but I'll just put it here, because I don't have space. Otherwise, and this was a business um, transaction, so HP, it's always easier for me, I feel like, when I zoom in and write, instant ink. And that was for three, 325, let's see, yeah, 325. I actually need to look into that because I don't know that I need that service. I really don't print stuff very often. So I'll just do that there. Okay, so let's get started by tracking our transactions. Um, last time we left off, it was the 10th, I believe, and we've had quite a bit obviously go on since then. One thing I did wanna make sure I track is my, um, the car wash. We got the other car washed when we were preparing to move and things like that and that was $6.99, so we'll do gas first. So we've got, I don't think we have anything over here, no. So we just have the car wash and then we filled up both cars. So let me take out my phone. So we had $6.99 for the car wash and then $35.21 for the Dodge Journey and $30.70 for the Avenger, so $72.90 is what we had for gas. I'm just gonna check those off real quick, just so we know we did track them. We're still working on our December budget, so I'm hoping to have that video up next week for you guys. Okay, and then I'm just gonna take my lasso and copy that, and we'll paste that down here, oops. Copy. Oops, <laughs> I keep doing this. Um, so you wanna make sure the images is unchecked in the lasso tool when you're copying and pasting with the inserts because otherwise it will pick up the insert. But if you uncheck the images, it will not do that. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna be a little over on gas. So 72.90, oops, need my pen on. 
and we had 60 21 remaining last week so that gives us 12 69 over and I meant to do that in red so I'll just change the color real quick I really love that feature Okay, so that takes care of gas, and then we'll look at stickers and designs. So I did get my January stickers from Sarah Marie Stickers on the 15th. That was the day that she released them. And then I also did pick up some custom scripts from her um, on that day. And then my littlest one <laughs> destroyed my skinny washi that I had for my January sticker, so I had to get more of that. And then I also picked up a Monday Start monthly sticker set because I think I might, starting in January, do the Monday Start because then it like lines up with my digital planner and I feel like that just makes more sense to me. Plus every week like that I'm planning in my Daily Duo starts on Monday anyways. So I'm gonna give that a try and see how that goes. Um, but let's go ahead and add that all up. So it's 54.92 for my January. 54.92 and then I'll just check that off while I'm here and then 17.61 for the custom scripts and then 6.21 for those other little random things so it's 78.74 so I'm pretty sure we're going to be over here to yeah, because last week we had 5710 remaining. So if I subtract that, we're 2162 over. Oh, whoops. Let's see, what? Uh, plus 5710. Okay, so 78, 78, 74, and then minus 5710. There we go. 2164 over. Okay, and then let's see here. So for unbudgeted, we did have one transaction, and that was uh, my husband took the girls to Big Five and they picked up some like frisbees and balls and different things to play over in the park and then he got an air pump as well to pump up the balls. Um, it's just so nice here right now that we decided to invest a little bit of money just to kind of take the girls out. Julia is obsessed with playing with like basketballs, tennis balls, soccer balls, like she is obsessed. So it's really fun getting her out in the field and watching her like throw the balls around and kick them around and all that kind of stuff. And they got um, some of those like felt um, or Velcro mitts where you can throw the tennis ball and it sticks to the mitt and all that kind of stuff. So they just wanted to get some things to like play outside, which I think is important for kids and it is so nice here right now. So that was 4661, definitely worth it. They've been out there every day playing so 4661 and nothing remaining there so I think that's it as far as transactions are concerned yeah I got that right so the next thing we'll do is we will check our cash envelopes and I'm probably going to film my November results video next week because we do still have some transactions that need to come out and everything plus we have you know the whole weekend and things like that i can tell you right now i'm pretty sure as far as cash is concerned i'm pretty sure that we have nothing left but let me just double check real quick um so let's put this out i got a more gender neutral <laughs> little uh binder to put the envelopes in or and everything because my husband was not a big fan of taking the pink one out with him and stuff like that so yeah we do not have any um, cash left so these are the four categories that we do get cash for there's groceries household eating out and entertainment and we used all of our eating out entertainment money primarily during the move uh, we ate out quite a bit but we've been having home cooked meals the last few nights my husband made this amazing amazing mahi dish uh, mahi mahi dish with like a lemon garlic cream sauce last night it was 
so good. <laughs> so, so good. It was just really nice to have these like home cooked meals after eating out so much in this uh, past week or so. But yeah, and then today uh, for Thanksgiving, we did order um, food from Boston Market. Uh, we had a gift card for there, so we decided to order our Thanksgiving dinner. We're not getting together with family because um, as you may know, my mom is having like chemo treatments right now, and so it's really important for her immune system and everything that we don't risk her getting sick. And then, um, yeah, so we're just gonna do something small at home, just the four of us. We've got some board games ready to go. Uh, we're probably gonna watch some movies and just have a really chill day. I was gonna try to get a lot of work done today, but I think I'm just gonna film this video. Uh, maybe after the girls go to bed, I'll film tomorrow or edit tomorrow's video. And that's pretty much all I'm gonna do today. I really want to just kind of spend time with family today and soak in some time and just be together. It's been a whirlwind. <laughs> of a week this past week and I think we all just need to relax and have a just chill day at home. So that's our plan for Thanksgiving. I'm excited to try Boston Market's meal. I told my husband, I was like, this could easily end up being a tradition for us because <laughs> if you think about it, like the cost of it was I think $79.99 for the Thanksgiving dinner and it comes with um, turkey, gravy, mashed potatoes, stuffing, rolls, and dessert. So it comes with all that stuff, um, which is perfect for us, and we don't have to cook anything. And if you buy all those separate ingredients, you'd probably end up spending just about that, if not more. Um, so I know there's something special about cooking Thanksgiving dinner as well, and we definitely wanna do that in the future, but for this year, with as much as we've had going on, we're like, we're gonna take the easy route and order our Thanksgiving dinner. And Boston Market's really good. I've eaten there before, so I'm excited. But anyways, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to catch all my future videos, and I will see you all later. Bye.